Steel structure. The rest of it is a um, hardboard. Um, a gentleman called Frank Shepherd, who's been doing it for 23 years. Um, First thing we look at uh, is whether the person is in the pre uh, in the press in in um, news daily. That's why we do it last minute. We try to portray um, what's wrong with the person and why why he's in the press. And obviously we we came up with these ideas because. Um, they are quite catching and people come here because of um, our figures are always quite controversial. It takes about five days to put together, so um, it's about four to six people working on it every day. She's completely fictional, uh, it was just a part of design and that's how it came out. We are a charitable organisation and we would like to obviously raise more money for charity. The main structure is um, steel uh, frame. The lower arms and lower uh, legs, head and all the accessories are made of uh, hardboard. Since the last 20 years we have been building the, the sort of celebrity effigy to be blown up alongside the giant Guy Fawkes that we have as well at the event on the night. We've had people like Russell Brand, Jonathan Ross, Katie Price, we've had both the Blairs, we've had um, Gordon Brown, we've had uh, last year we had Donald Trump. So we do have people from all realms that we decide upon who's going to be our giant effigy for the year. So the decision was made because he was the most prominent figure in the media at that time. And we're not poking fun at what he's done or any of the um, alleged allegations, um, but we have chosen him just because he is a big figure in the media. We did have um, Theresa May, we had um, Donald Trump, um, there were a couple of others, but we decided because we've done political uh, last year that we were going to um, not do a political figure this year. 